I recently installed the Wii Homebrew channel on my Wii, and I just want to show you what it does. This is the um, um, startup screen. You can see it's very professional. Looks really great. Uh, sorry. This is all the applications that I downloaded. Um, most of these are emulators. Uh, except for Tetris. Tetris is an actual um, game application, homebrew. Um, let's start with ScumBM. It's an emulator for point and click games. Let's see. Start. It's a really good emulator. There's no video lag. The um, good frame, frame rate. Great sound, um, it's a perfect emulator. You can skip through that. You can skip through that too. Um, you can walk around, look around, you can open things. And you can also save and load games. Okay, let's go back to the Wii, um, Wii Homebrew menu. Um, next one is SNES 9X. Um, it is a Super Nintendo emulator. Um, I could only find one game that actually works with this, and it's Mortal Kombat. I tried putting the Zelda Link to the Past game here, um, Mario Kart, and they don't work. But Mortal Kombat works, and it works pretty well. See, there's a trick to going back to the Wii menu. I don't really know what it is. There's buttons you gotta push. Okay, maybe it's not that button. Sometimes I would figure it out and it goes back to the main menu, but sometimes it just doesn't do it. Oh, there it is. See? If you push enough buttons, they'll uh, eventually go to this menu. Uh, Wii Homebrew Channel Reload. Okay, next one is Visual Boy Advance. It's supposed to emulate Game Boy games and Game Boy Advance games.
we can try the Pokemon pinball game. Okay, unlike the last two emulators, this one doesn't have very good sound, but it can still play um, games fairly well. And it is a little slow, but it's still playable. Okay. And also you can um, save games in here. And you can load games in here. Go back to the Wii menu. Okay. And the last emulator is the Wii 64. Um, out of the four, this one's the least capable. It comes with F-Cube. Whenever you download this application, it'll come with this. Um, I've tried other games in here too, like the Zelda Ocarina of Time and Mario games. And I found that the graphics, the, the 3D graphics has a lot of glitches, but it, it's still playable and it's a little slow. And to exit out of each game, you have to um, go to your Wii console, the actual Wii console, and push the reset button. And last is Tetris Wii. This is just um, a Tetris game.